Hi, I'm Bex Thompson, and I'm really excited today to be sharing a brand new event with you, a one day couples immersion. And I'm filming this now in my kitchen because I wanted to kind of get real with you, yeah? Even as, you know, an event manager, as, as a teacher and, and personal development coach, I have a life. I have kids, I have a husband, I have a kitchen, I have a house that needs looking after, you know, as well as all the things I do with my clients. And in a relationship, we need to put as much emphasis on that as we do on these other aspects of our life. Now, who watching this feels that their intimate relationship or their loving relationship doesn't get as much attention as it deserves? Or it stays on the superficial. Maybe you have a date night, you know, maybe you, know, you go out for a walk. But are you being seen and heard the way that you really want? Are you getting the level of connection and intimacy that you really crave? Despite feeling perhaps comfortable, is there a sense or a niggling sense that there is something missing or that you've lost something that you used to have in the early days? Now, it doesn't really matter whether you've been in a relationship for a short time with this person or whether, like me, you've been in a relationship with someone for decades. These things can start to creep in as day-to-day -day life takes over. If you are yearning to really come back to a place of love, if, if you want to stop not saying things for fear of upsetting someone or getting rejected or, or the potential of maybe being ridiculed or misunderstood, then this workshop is for you. This is about coming back to a place of love. This is about dissolving those little mini irritations, triggers and resentments that build up and start to put sort of an invisible wall or chasm between you that you don't even realize is there. Now, sometimes it might just be one of us, not both of us, that, that feels like there's some room to grow. And I know from my own experience that that can sort of instill a little bit of fear in the other person. When I spoke to Rich, my husband, about this, he said that before we started doing this work, his fear was that we might open up a can of worms or you know, take the lid off something that was unfixable, that by doing this work, we were going to expose something and that was actually going to make us fall apart. But what turned him around was this desire that there could be more and that actually if we didn't look at how we could come closer together, it was going to be that that was going to break us apart. And actually doing this work has given us a platform for a much deeper level of communication and connection, a different way of being intimate with each other without performance, without pressure, without expectation. And our relationship is thriving. After 25 years, it's the best it's been. And I would love that for you because so many of the people I work with are sharing that they're having some relationship, not maybe difficulties, but sometimes it's just not the best that it could be, right? It doesn't feel broken, but it doesn't feel like it's the best it could be either. And I would love to bring couples into this space because I know how potent and how powerful it is. And after 25 years of working on my own personal and spiritual development, being able to now integrate that into my family in a way that is not challenging, that is not um, having any expectations, and that is not you know, judgmental. This is a very inclusive, very connecting work. We want you to feel really safe, really supported in this work. It's going to be a beautiful day. So if this feels like something that you feel drawn to, that you would like to maximize your relationship, then I would love you to join us. Check out the link below and that has all the details of how you can book. And I would love to see you there. If you have any questions at all, please just message me privately and I'd be more than happy to have a conversation with you about whether this is right for you. Because if you are in crisis in your relationship right now, then you may need one-on-one -on -one work. But if you're okay, but you just feel like everything's kind of running along, pretty okay, but you just have this nagging feeling that you don't really want to keep it going just like this. You want a little more from your relationship. You want to rekindle that lost flame and deepen your connection. Then this work is going to be beautiful for you. So I look forward to seeing you then or speaking to you if you have any questions about this.